J.D. Vance goes on ABC uh, this week with Martha Raddatz about this. And here's what happened. Go. Of course, President Trump was actually in Aurora, Colorado, talking to people on the ground. And what we're hearing, of course, Martha, is that people are terrified by what has happened with some of these Venezuelan gangs. Sen and Senator and Vance, I'm, I'm going to stop you because I know exactly what happened. Martha. I'm going to stop you. The incidents were limited to a handful of apartment complex, uh, apartment complexes. And the mayor said our dedicated police officers have acted on those concerns. A handful of problems. Only, Martha, do you hear yourself? Only a handful of apartment complexes in America were taken over by Venezuelan gangs, and Donald Trump is the problem, and not Kamala Harris's open border. Americans are so fed up with what's going on, and they have every right to be. And I, I really find this exchange, Martha, sort of interesting because you seem to be more focused with nitpicking everything that Donald Trump has said rather than acknowledging that apartment complexes in the United States of America are being taken over by violent gangs. Okay, let's, let's, just, let's just end that with they did not invade or take over the city, as Donald Trump said. Uh, I, I want to move on to Just a few women. apartment complexes, no big deal. <laughs> oh, boy, did Vance wax her. Ooh. Vance, you got to do it. Got to do that. Now, uh, later in the program, uh, Ms. Raddatz um, asked a good question of the Kentucky uh, Governor Andy Bashir, a Democrat. I'm not going to run a new soundbite, but I want to be fair, all right, uh, that she did challenge him uh, on uh, Harris's policies. But Vance it was uh, pretty interesting. Thank you for watching. To view full episodes of the No Spin News anytime, sign up to become a BillOReilly.com premium or concierge member today.